how to use GitHub Desktop in conjunction with Xcode in order to sync it with GitHub on the web. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to open a new browser and go to desktop.github.com. That's where you can get the download for GitHub Desktop. This was formerly GitHub for Mac, it's now GitHub Desktop. So go ahead and download that and follow the instructions in order to install that. What I'm going to do right now is I'm going to make a new Xcode project and we're just going to create a new project. I'm going to call this Demo Project. Okay, this is real important. Make sure down here this is checked. Create Git repository on Mac. That's going to get this project set up to uh, be on GitHub. Okay, that's actually all we're going to do with this project, so I'm going to close that out. Let's go to GitHub Desktop. Okay, so at this point, you can see some of uh, these are some of my old repositories that I've already set up on here. Now to create a new one, I'm going to go over here to this plus sign and I'm going to hit plus. And I'm going to choose add and browse to the location of my app. So if we go to desktop, demo project, here it is right here. And I'm going to go ahead and click open and add repository. Okay, you can see demo project has been added here. And here are the, is the contents of the files that I have right now. Now, in order to push this to the GitHub on the web, uh, all I need to do is I need to create um, some sort of summary here, some message of what I've done. So uh, I'm gonna say minor changes and before I publish it, just so you know that it's not already there, let's go to GitHub. Now this requires, of course, that you've made a GitHub account already. So if you haven't done that, you're gonna to need to do that for this step. I'm gonna to go to my profile. And here, I'm gonna click on my repositories. You can see some of my previous repositories, okay? So let's go back to GitHub desktop. And you can see I have one uncommitted change, right? That's this minor changes. If I click over here on publish, it's going to ask me to name the project because we're making a new repository. So you only have to do that one time. I'm going to click push repository and you'll get this pushing to GitHub message. Now let's go back to GitHub, refresh, and you can see my demo project is right here. Let's go ahead and open that and add a readme. Okay, I'm gonna say oh, my first project push. Okay, and let's go down here to commit new file. Excellent. Now, if we go back to GitHub Desktop, and we need, if we want to pull that back from the, our change we made on the web, we're going to need to click Sync here. And we can actually see that if we go to our history here. We can see initial commit. This is when the file was first made. Create readme. That was what I did. And I wrote, wow, my very first project push. Awesome. Let's go to the actual files on the finder. I'm going to go to the desktop where I saved it. And if I click on demo project, I can see there's actually a readme file now that's created. Let's double click on that and say, I'm adding another small change. And we can go ahead and close that and we'll want to save. Now notice GitHub desktop knows that we have changed it here because if we go to two if we click on this, it says two uncommitted changes. And if we look at what those were, read me, I'm adding another small change. So if I wanted to push that, I can say added a small change. Now we're going to want to commit to master here and go ahead and click sync. You need to hit sync 
any time that you're pulling information from the web to GitHub Desktop or pushing from desktop to the web. Let's go over here, look at the web. Oh, I don't see it. That's because we need to refresh. Okay, I'm adding another small change. Good. So at this point, we've created a new repository on desktop GitHub, GitHub Desktop. We've pushed it to the web GitHub. We've made some minor changes. We've synced it back to our actual computer locally, made some changes there, and pushed it back. And you can do that as many times as you want, and you will as you work on your project. Okay, good luck.